with all the advancements in technology and artificial intelligence, what is the one clearly defined measurable event that indicates the claim, a workers' compensation claim, is high risk and may need some additional resources on that claim? Hello, my name is Michael Stack, and I'm the CEO of AMAX. And today I want to talk about one of the concepts I heard a lot about at the national conference that we had recently is the advancements in AI. The advancements in AI and how awesome it is and how these claim systems and RIMA systems are all coming out with these super cool predictive analytics type tools leveraging AI and reading natural language in order to indicate and give us a predictor of whether or not a claim, a single claim, is at a higher risk to become what we call a creeping catastrophic claim or a claim that starts off as a simple shoulder injury and keeps that person out of work for the rest of their life, significantly driving up costs and significantly decreasing the quality of life for that individual. Now, do not hear me wrong. AI is awesome. Huge, huge, cool tool. Super awesome. Super awesome in what it does for us in the advancements and how quickly it's advancing in our world and the tools and technology that we can leverage in order to do some of this stuff. Super cool. Here's a concept I want you to take away here. The tactics, the tactics, the tactics, which is leveraging artificial intelligence, leveraging technology, that is a tactic. That tactic is going to continue to change. It's going to continue to evolve. It's going to continue to improve as time goes on. What the AI of today is going to look very different than the AI, uh, AI of 10 years from now. This tactic is going to change very rapidly. The principle is not going to change. The principle is not going to change at all. It never does. It hasn't changed in, in hundreds and thousands of years, and it's not going to change in hundreds of thousands of years from now. So what is the principle? The principle that we need to pull out, and then the measurable tactic, the measurable tactic that doesn't isn't going to change. It's not going to change over time. Here's the principle. We need an indicator. We need an indicator. We need an indicator. We need a trigger. We need an indicator. We need a trigger. We need something to let us know, hey, this claim is at high risk. We need it to be clearly defined. We need it to be predictable. Here's what I, here's what I want you to do. Here's the principle. Participation. 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 How part willing and engaged is that injured worker in the claims process? How willing and engaged are they? It doesn't matter how much AI we have. It doesn't matter how much the development of technology changes. Human behavior is still going to remain the same and the cornerstone of what we're doing in workers' compensation. Human behavior, <clears throat> no matter how much technology changes, that injured worker is still going to have to participate. They're going to have to participate in talking to an AI bot. They're going to have to participate in talking to a case manager. They're going to have to participate in talking to their manager. They're going to have to participate in talking to a doctor, whether it's through telemedicine or on-site or whatever principle or tactic changes. This idea of participation is not going to change. You need to understand the principle and leverage it for your benefit. Leverage it for your benefit. The first and clearly defined measurable, measurable event in being able to predict whether a claim is going to be a creeping catastrophic claim or not is participation. It's participation. Always has been, always will be, no matter what the tactic is. Remember, your work today, workers' compensation, can have a dramatic impact on your company's bottom line, particularly if you understand these ideas of principles and tactics. But it will have a dramatic impact on somebody's, someone's life, as we've talked about here. So be great.